Is this the childhood home of Jesus Christ? Archaeologists believe so. Is this first century structure carved into a limestone hill the place where Jesus grew up? Professor Ken Dark from the University of Reading has spent 14 years combing over the holy hideaway made of bricks and mortar. Speaking to BBC News last month, he revealed, I was actually doing a study of the city's history as a Byzantine Christian pilgrimage center. However, an old story about Jesus Christ's childhood home diverted him somewhat. The result is a new book about this neglected yet essential chapter of biblical history. Jesus' supposed house was once the crypt of a Byzantine church, specifically constructed to protect it according to historical accounts. On top of the church is a convent, which gives the book its title, The Sisters of Nazareth Convent, a Roman period Byzantine and Crusader site in central Nazareth. It was published in September. Our Savior's old stomping ground sounds not a million miles away from a modern-day listing. The Daily Mail writes the dwelling is probably a courtyard house which has living and storage rooms plus a roof terrace. That said, not many locations have a doorway cut from solid stone with stairs hewn from the same way. Compressed chalk exists instead of carpet. Traces of pottery were also found in the interior. Sitting quietly on a side street, the Sisters of Nazareth convent is now part of Central Nazareth 2020. Its neighbors include the famous Church of the Annunciation, another site like an architectural Russian doll. Professor Dark and others believe the Byzantine structure over Jesus' house is the Church of the Nutrition, also known as the Church of Joseph's Workshop. Website See the Holy Land describes it as a solid and unpretentious building. Saint Joseph may be thought of as a simple carpenter, however, in the good book he's called a tecton, the ancient word for craftsman, writes BBC News. That craftsmanship went beyond the treatment of wood, it appears. He may have created the limestone house in the first place. Dark took his cue as the church's identity from the Locus Sanctus, an account written by Adamnan, an Irish monk in the 7th century. The abbot and statesman coined the name Church of Nutrition because of the way Christ was nourished on the sacred premises. And of course, much work was done prior to Professor Dark. Jesus' house, or what's believed to be so, was initially talked about by French scholar and explorer Victor Guerin in 1888. Nuns stumbled on the ancient cistern, sparking off the ecclesiastical excitement. The home was then excavated on and off over a period of approximately 80 years till 1964. Jesuit priest Henry Sens was the man who previously kept the faith before Dark revived people's interest. The professor published an article on his findings in 2015. He can't say for certain whether this is Christ's child at home, but for him it's a likely destination. Quoting from his article, the Metro reports, It's impossible to say on archaeological grounds, but nor is there any archaeological reason why such an identification need to be discounted. Speaking to the mail, Dark stressed his conclusions draw on what texts tell us the Byzantines perceived. He added there's recent evidence that considerably strengthens the case.